What up, everybody? It is Rhino. Welcome back, Madden 13 with Shane Falco. As we are going against the Golden Boy, Tom Brady, and the New England Patriots. Thankfully, we are at home. Actually, not really thankfully, because I would love to beat the Patriots in New England and get my Eli Manning on. Let's go! Here we are. At oh, hello, friends, and uh, happy holidays. Merry Christmas. Jim Nance and Phil Simms getting set for kickoff, and hope you're having a great holiday season. We've got some football coming your way. Yeah, I think we got some exciting football coming. Give me that ball. Enjoy the holidays and enjoy this game today. Holiday season. This is what, what week? Fort? No, we're 14 in, so this is 15. Oh, yeah, so we're around Christmas time. All right. All right, Christmas time it is. In the center. All righty. Now, as someone that went to school in New England, I mean, I'm, I'm from Jersey. So it's like the Patriots don't really mean anything. Because as a Giants fan, Patriots don't mean anything. Because I'm not a Jets fan. If I was a Jet fan, then yeah, it would mean something. But as a uh, as a Giants fan, Patriots don't really mean anything. You should clap that. They don't really mean anything. But then, when I go to school in New England, Patriots kind of mean something. Because my God, I learned something. Or at least the ones that went to my school. Their fans are stupid. Grant, I feel like I could say that about basically any team ever. It's like, I mean, there are so many stupid fans. Oh, not even stupid fans. There are stupid people in the world. But my God. Of course the Golden Boy scores. Why wouldn't he? But my God. The people that went to my school, they didn't know anything. And when the Giants beat them in the Super Bowl to ruin their undefeated season, ah, oh, uh, might as well have been Christmas 24/7. When you talk about throwing the football into open space, that's almost always against zone defense. That was a gift that kept on giving. Good job of the quarterback throwing it in there. Out of the shotgun formation, the throw to the left. Catch that one? No. All right, that's cool. That one didn't even get to you, though, so I can't really blame you. Let's go with this play again, because this actually worked. Come out in the dime package. Drop back. Shotgun formation. Same guy. I like it. Oh, that's right. Tate's hurt, isn't he? Damn. Forgot about that. I don't know how long he's out for. Oh, no. Yeah, there he is. So I don't know what the hell's going on right now. Yeah, screw this, I'm out here. First down? Yeah. There, yeah. There's that symbol. Oh, God. No! Name of the game is hit the guy with the football. Isn't it? No. That's what it is. The Easy. It. With the, the, the things. Spin. What a nice play. Gets to him that time and gets the big hit. Alrighty. The defense comes out of the Why isn't Tate in that formation? I'm good at it. Flag, what happened? Roughing the passer? Yep. They done roughed me up, man. You took a few of these shots in your day. Give me that first down. Yeah, nowadays these guys, they I, I believe the quarterback is overprotected. This, they are. To me, this is a Good bad Phil. Uh, oh, oh, bad, bad Phil. Oh, god damn it. That was a terrible throw by Shut up, Phil. Damn it, Tom Brady. Stop it. I hate you, Tom Brady. I want you to know that. You backed up at Michigan. Just want you to remember. To Drew Henson. You're Drew Henson's backup. How, how would he do in the pros? 
Cowboy fans. Oh, hey, me! Touchdown and drawing close. Now, uh, Janikowski, start to piss me off. First and ten. Don't become Looking feely. That's not something you want to do. It's not something you want to strive for, is becoming Jay Feely. They load up one side with a whole flock of receivers. Bye. Oh, I'm scoring, I'm scoring, I'm scoring, I'm scoring. No, I'm not. Drew Mayo, he's, uh, he's pretty decent right here. Sproles, you're an idiot. That was not the right thing at all. It's being stupid. If you didn't cut back, you would have been in the friggin' end zone the first time. Damn it, Darren Sproles. I hate you. You're never getting the ball again. You're done. Why am I doing this play? This was probably not my best idea. Oh, no, it was. Okay, never mind. That's why I'm doing that play. Don't point to the name on your back. Hey, he made it, finally. Now we're down one because of the freaking idiot. Gotta go deep. First and ten. He wants to go deep. Kind of have to. There's only 20 seconds left. Oh, baby. Call that timeout. Hey, Bay, you monster. Hey, Bay, Bay. You can have the perfect throw, the perfect catch, and a big play. Oh, my God. Look at this. Oh, come on. Did not see that guy. Well, the clock is stopped, so I called the timeout. The offensive line gets in position. Can they protect their quarterback? Oh my god, are you serious? That was a touchdown. It hit him in the hands. Oh my goodness gracious. I should have done a bullet pass for that. Take all the leg strength he can muster. Nothing drives a coach crazier than a Are you serious? Just me? Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. Hey, he still made it. It's like, why would you take a delay game there? It's like, what the hell was that? He was like, no, this isn't, this isn't hard enough. I need to make this more difficult. Oh my god! I know a lot of people are going to be surprised by this, but when you take those blindside hits, they don't hurt as much as you think because you had no idea it was coming, your body's loose, and you can absorb the hit. Defense comes to the line. Okay, so it doesn't hurt as bad as a thing that would cripple you, but it still hurts like a mutter. I was about to say, do they even have Wilfork? But I found him. Hey, guess what? We're down by one. You want to know who to bl who's to blame there? Janikowski. Friggin' missing. How do you miss an extra point? It's almost as bad as that, uh... Well, actually, it's not even close to as bad. That Jacksonville game, when they did, uh... I think it was a kickoff or play I forget which it was but they did all those laterals and they did it for at least a minute and a half and they scored but the uh so they were down by one but the kicker missed the extra point so they still lost 
Oh man, that must have sucked. But a good play there in another incomplete pass. I would not have been happy if I was a Jaguars fan. I wouldn't be happy as a Jaguars fan if, you know, anything. Jaguars play on a Sunday. Nike. Sucks to be a Jaguars fan. I mean, they had MJD. But, you know, he sucked this season. And I know because he was on my fantasy team. But he got hurt. So. But he didn't suck as bad as Chris Johnson. He sucked. Jerk. I also had him on my fantasy team. Why would you just sit there? Your route is to keep running, Sanders, you moron. Good job that time by the defense. I completely expected him to just keep running. That's why I freaking threw it to him. And he's like, nope, I'm just going to sit here. You know, right behind the middle linebacker. That's a good spot to be. Oh, there's Vince. You are not going to be an accurate quarterback, of course, when you're under this kind of this kind of pressure. Doesn't even have time to set his feet. Another throw offline. I agree, Phil. What is with this sunset? Down following that incompletion. Screen pass. What? What are you doing? Oh man, that was too much work. I have to go out of bounds now. What? Stop being a baby. Wide receivers gotta be a little braver. Oh my God, are you serious? Okay, so up difficulty means you fumble all the time. That's cool. Keep moving. We got momentum. The momentum of one play. Shane? Okay, there you go. I was about to say, where's Shane? The one guy we need. Can we hold them to field goal tries and not give up the touchdowns? Here we are. They got more than a seven-point lead. Can you hold them till field goal try? Well, we'll find out. Running away from the sack. Quarterback giving See how smart on that one. And you can see how they fared in the red zone to this point, which is brought to you by Verizon. I was going to say, I tried doing a hurry up. I don't know if it registered. In the air in the red zone. All right, all right. Who's hurt? Okay, good. You jerk, that's what you get for trying to tackle me. Take those points. Just take the one. Because, I mean, I'm going for a touchdown. I'm not going for a field goal. I'm not playing. I'm not playing for no tie. The formation here, shotgun, makes the reception. All right, trying to get my Eli Magic going here. Just like I said at the beginning of the episode, I hit deep fork. I don't know why. I just agreed with the coach. I don't really have a reason for it. Okay, that's why. Of course, duh. Now who's hurt? Tate, of course. Because why wouldn't Tate be hurt? Yes. Yeah, baby. What's the score? Alright, so if we get the extra point, we're up by three. Easy enough. Crap. All right, now I really have to get my Eli Manning on. Now first and ten. 
the quarterback throws to the right. Good piece of back. Good start. Now we'll call a timeout. Why not? Alrighty. Quarterback coming to the and keep calm and keep my composure. For a time in this game. The margin of error against man to man defense is much smaller for a quarterback than it would be against zone defenses. That time the quarterback uh -huh. right on target. Good throw. They've got a first down now after that catch. He'll fire it out to the left. Touchdown. Now the problem is, did I give Tom Brady too much time? So kids, they grow up, they want to be wide receivers. I don't I blame them. They're out there, they get to catch the football, they get to score. Touch. Incomplete. Six yards, yeah, keep throwing those six yard passes. Masakoi. Just sounds like a soccer player. Incomplete. S. Smith. Steve Smith? Like, the former Giant or the former, or the current Panther? Oh, yes! Yes! I channeled my inner Eli. Sure was. Hell of a game. But I won. Take that, Tom Brady. Alright, guys, that is where we end this episode. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Remember to leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe if you guys want to see more. Peace.